What is going on everybody? My name is Pete and you guys are watching Pay to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs coming at you once again with another brand new video. I hope you're all doing fantastic out there. So ladies and gentlemen of the jury, uh, if you guys drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats or any of the others, you my friend should definitely be subscribed to this channel with all notifications turned on. That's right, everybody, if you wanna stay up to date with what's going on in the gig economy. So get started right now and hit that red subscribe button. It's free, everybody. Can't You can't argue with free, you know? So hit that button, uh, turn on the notifications. And of course, if you wouldn't mind it, hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know that I'm doing a good job. And uh, yeah, leave a comment saying liked, L-I-K-E-D, just so I know you did it. And let's jump to the email, Triple Lindy, Thornton Mill and Style, and here we go. All right, so this comes from Scott. He goes, hi, Pete, Scott again. I just watched your post on rejecting orders. Yes, if I reject a few and give the correct reason, order to small or distance too far, I will start getting orders for better payouts or closer deliveries. Now, I've spoken about this a few times, just so you guys know, and some people have agreed with it that it does make a difference. Other people have said that it has not made a difference. So keep that in mind. Uh, this works, or at least it has worked for a month now. Uh, the average order in my town is $5.50, very few and rare double digit payouts. Yeah, see, that's a that's a slow, not so great market. Uh, all the orders that go to hospitals, independent doctor's offices, emergency services, detention centers, jail, and the rich zone, the rich zone largest delivery here are no tip orders. I actually heard a nurse tell another nurse that she did not have to leave a tip because they were entitled. I felt like asking entitled to what, but I did not. I have stopped taking these orders with no tip. No one is entitled to waste my time and destroy my car except me because it's mine. Well said. DoorDash has a number they want for your zone. Let's say it's 10 drivers. If they have 10, then Dash Now is not available. And there will be no time in that slot for you to set a schedule. However, if they want 10 drivers and only have eight, then the app will let you dash now and the red area will show up with two lines, uh, one line for every driver that their model of 10 is short. They will also turn this on if they have low paying orders that have been rejected and can't get drivers that are on to take them. Interesting, I didn't know about that. Uh, drivers need to keep in mind, this has nothing to do with the amount of real orders in your zone. It's what they want to have in your zone, but do not. I can't tell you how many times I have jumped on and gotten low paying orders sent to me as soon as I sign on to, sign on to Dash or sat in a parking lot waiting for nothing. Interest, very interesting, Scott. And just, I just wanna comment on the, um, on the thing there about the nurses saying that they're entitled and everything. So we know that ever since the pandemic has started, our frontline workers, the, the nurses, the doctors, uh, surgeons, you know, just everyone in the hospital system, uh, we know that they have been working their asses off. They've been putting their lives on the line, um, you know, to help people. But I know some will argue with me, but delivery drivers, especially in the beginning, in the heat of the pandemic, you know, we were frontline workers too, putting ourselves on the line to deliver food to people that were trying to stay home and stay safe, okay? So why is it okay to say, well, I don't even wanna tip a dollar to the person bringing me my food because I'm entitled and I'm putting my life on the line, you know? I get what they're saying. They are extremely, extremely important people and I am not discounting that in the least bit because without them, we'd be in even hotter water than we are right now. However, I still don't think it makes them exempt that they should not have to tip or feel like, well, I don't have to tip. Because then the question is, why even say, why, why, you're almost saying like you almost don't even have to pay for the food too. So it's okay to pay for the food, right? To pay the restaurant, make sure they get paid. But the person bringing you the food shouldn't be paid. You know what I mean? That's where I, I, I have to step in a little bit and say, eh, not quite. You know, you're definitely an important worker. Don't get me wrong, okay? I couldn't do what you do. But the fact is this, uh, the delivery drivers are busting their asses to make sure that you get your food. 
so that you can continue working at your job to help people. So the delivery drivers are extremely important people, just as are, just as the rideshare drivers are too, with getting a lot of those medical workers to their jobs. So that's where I have to disagree with the nurse saying that, well, I'm entitled, so therefore I don't have to tip. I, I don't agree with that 100%. I really don't. Um, so just wanted to put my two cents in. What do you guys think about what I was just saying and what Scott was saying about the rejecting of orders and what his market is like? Let me know in the chat or the comments. And of course, if any of you guys out there have a topic, a story, an article, whatever, uh, definitely send me an email. Paid to drive stories at gmail.com is the best way to reach me. Or for a quicker response, you guys can reach out to me and message me through Patreon at patreon.com forward slash paid to drive. That link is in the description down below or in the pin top comment. So if you guys want to sign up on there, that's where you do it. And anyone who does sign up as a way of saying thank you is I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos. So I'm going to do that right now. When you hear your name called, say, hey, Pete, I heard my name. All right. We've got the ge very generous Samantha Michaels, John Birchfield, Brian Pomeroy, Brian Medina, Heidi Barnes, Ivan Jerome Gilroy, Joe Valerio, Angelo Counts McCarty, Kurt Paul, Lee Peacock, Tulsa Todd, William Boudreau, Laura Love, Agus, Tom Perry, Alan G. Van Horn, Lawrence Brown, Drew Hanor, Fernando Carranza, Frank Havilan, uh, Fresh One, Jason Casta, Justin Case, Lulu Laura, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Freisner, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Joyce Hine, Brian Richardson, Kenny Bess, Ginny Thomas, Candace Mitchell, John Bonacci, Matt Epperson, Nick G, Stacey Miller, Terrence Pacheco, and Valerie Brown. Huge shout outs to every single one of you guys. Really, really appreciate you all. So with that being said, if you guys want to sign up, links are in the description or the pin top comment. Who's going to be the next patron? I don't know. Let's find out. Maybe it'll be you. And with that being said, everybody, uh, I hope all of you are signed up on the Get Upside Gas app. It's a free app for your smartphone so you can save money every time you go to the gas pump. I have the link in the description down below. Just scroll down the page. Click on the link that says Get the Free Gas app. And uh, it'll tell you how to download it and install it on whatever kind of phone, tablet, or device you use. And then you go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside Gas app, and within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Link's in the description down below. Make sure to download it today. And uh, yeah, guys, so uh, also, if you want to get one of these Live to Drive, Drive to Live t-shirts, you can get your own at paidtodrivestore.com. That's right. Links down below in the pin top, uh, top comment in the description. And uh, yeah, new designs, colors, sizes, you name it. We probably have it on sale every day. Paytodrivestore.com. Links in the description of the pin top comment. And if you made it to the end of this video, simply leave a comment saying end 304 END 304 just lets me know you made it to the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe with all notifications turned on down below for free and hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. Leave a comment saying liked L I K E D just so I know you did it. And until next time, get that money, get that honey, keep hustling, keep bustling. And we'll see you next time right here on Paid to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs. And as always, drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace, everybody. Later.